Welcome back, everybody. A couple of weeks ago, we got a message from viewers asking about the shortage of paper towels. They've been difficult to find for a number of months now. Yeah, we actually did a bit of an experiment. We went almost a dozen different times to local Wegmans, Tops, Target, and Walgreens stores, different times of the day, different locations. There wasn't a single paper towel for sale any time I went to those stores. <laughs> Sometimes you can find them, but oftentimes it is pretty difficult. So Mary Alice stores are getting creative right now. They're even turning to foreign manufacturers to try to help out. Yeah, more on that in a moment. First, what Michelle Mahaffey with Wegmans told us about why these products are so hard to keep in stock. The paper towel industry is actually still recovering from all of the panic shopping that occurred early on in the pandemic. The paper towel industry is one of the oldest manufacturing industries in the country and many were already at capacity prior to the pandemic. Um, we could also say that more people are at home, which means they're cleaning more often, they're using more disinfectants. The limited supply of the disinfecting wipes has actually forced customers to shift back to the traditional paper towel and spray bottle cleaners. Here at Wegmans, we're helping our customers by continuing with product limits, purchase limits for these items. We are working with brands certainly that we haven't carried in a while. Um, we've also found that brands that we haven't previously worked with prior to March, we also sought out paper manufacturers who really serve other markets like perhaps restaurants, who are now producing products for retail. So we've been able to use those products as well on our stores. And on that note, Mary Alice, if you look at your screen, I took this picture. Um, there was actually a delivery from Wegmans that one of my friends had sent to my house because we were watching the Bills game this past weekend. And these are the paper towels um, that came, you can see, totally in Spanish. That's right, right. Yeah, suggesting it likely was not intended to be sold here necessarily. But Wegmans, like a lot of companies, and just like Michelle mentioned, uh, they're really getting creative. Yeah, there is English on the other side of that paper towels, but clearly, clearly those were not intended to be sold here, but they're getting creative. We also asked Michelle if she has any tips or tricks for people so that they can get to the stores when the shelves are the most stocked. Unfortunately, it turns out. It doesn't have anything to do with the time of day you're shopping because we're getting we're getting inventory all day every day. So to think that oh well I'll I'll be at the store first thing in the morning so I can get those items that's not necessarily the case because it, depending on the store depending on when those items are coming in and 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 heading out on the shelves it could be different at every location. You know, it's like, Michael, people have forgotten, you know, back in the day when we'd take rags and use them and <laughs> wash them and reuse them. Everybody wants their paper towels. They want things that are disposable. Kim DeGeorge, our digital director, is such a sweetheart. She offered today to give me a couple of her rolls of bounty Aww. because literally I, I did this as an experiment because it was a viewer who called probably a couple of weeks ago and was like, Michael, I can't find paper towels anywhere. What's going on? So I was like, I'm just going to go to stores and document it and see if I can actually find any. And it so turned out I needed some myself. So <laughs> kill two birds with one stone. Couldn't find them anywhere. Yeah, you just don't have the lucky paper towel gene, apparently. <laughs> I've never had a problem getting enough, but, you know, I'm trying to use them sparingly. You know, we have a stack mm, right over there, but I feel like I'd get in trouble if y I took one. Yeah, and there are cameras all around our building, <laughs> Michael. Don't do it.